Hey guys, real quick, before we get started in today's video, first and foremost, thank you so much for 70,000 subscribers here on YouTube, man. We are so close to 100K. Let's keep working, and thank you so much. I really appreciate the support. Now, as promised, I told you guys that for 70K that we would do a Q&A video, so that video is coming up soon. If you have a question that you would like featured in the upcoming video, you guys can actually leave that question in this video in the comment section below just end it with hashtag ask gray so that i can find your questions and then answer them in the upcoming video i'm not gonna i'm not gonna promise i'm answering all the questions but i'll try to get to as many as i can all right here we go ladies and gentlemen the new tempest razorback assault rifle is now in modern warfare 2 this class setup will have you making plays like this Hang on. One more. Is there a guy next to me here? He's on the other side of this wall. I'm pretty sure there's a guy up here somewhere. Yep, there he is. There he is. Hey, I'm telling you guys, man, this class setup, this class setup that I got for this gun here, feels, feels really good. A very reliable build for the new Tempest Razorback catered towards damage output and accuracy. Is that That's a, not, a, not, pretty I'm sure? Bad. Eyes up. I'm saying the barrel. Good. I, just... I got him, I got him. Damn, I got that guy. Eyes up. All right, hey, what's going on, guys? How do you do? It's your boy Gray here, and welcome back to the channel. Ladies and gentlemen, as promised, today I am bringing you guys a must-try best class setup for the new Tempest Razorback Assault Rifle from the Season 4 Battle Pass. This is a really cool weapon, man. I do like the way that it performs. A lot of times I found myself, while I was leveling this thing up, I did find myself losing gunfights that I felt like I should have been, I should have had. I don't know. I was losing gunfights. I didn't just, I don't know. Maybe it was just the weapons, but once I got the right attachments for it and I mixed and matched a few things and with the specific tuning, this weapon was really, really good and very reliable out in the field. So, Give this setup a try, give this build a try, and make sure to use the specific tuning as I showcase in today's video. And I am using a suppressor, so let me show you guys real quick the perks that I'm using. So this right here is the perk package. I call it my stealth perk package. Uh, scavenger, bomb squad, fast hands, and ghost. All right, so first up here, guys, for the muzzle, we're actually using the Harbinger D20 suppressor. And for the tuning towards the recoil steadiness, that's a zero, that's a plus 0 0.86. And towards the bullet velocity, that's a plus 0 0.65. Next up here for the barrel, we're using the 18 inch TAC-2L barrel. And for the tuning, I don't know if this is a glitch or not. For the tuning, all I did was I upped the recoil steadiness. That's a plus 0 0.15. Uh, but I did realize that, oh, I don't know if, again, I don't know if this is a glitch or not but i tried to adjust the uh damage range tuning but it's weird because when you adjust the damage range it literally reduces the damage and it reduces the range so i'm like what's the point of increasing the tuning towards damage range if that's being reduced so i don't know if that's a glitch or what but yeah i just i just did the uh, recoil steadiness next up for the laser we're using the fss olev laser and for the tuning towards the sprint to fire speed i went negative 0.31 and towards aiming idle stability that's a plus 26.32 next up here for the stock we're using the ta 
ergo and for the tuning on this uh towards aim down sight speed that's a negative 2.58 and towards aiming idle stability that is a plus 0 0.93 and lastly here guys for the comb uh we're actually using the h1 precision and for the tuning towards the recourse stabilization that's a plus 0 0.19 towards aiming idle stability that is a plus 0 0.15 and that right there is the build you guys i mean this is a really good setup i like my class setups to be like really accurate where I don't have to think about too much about the recoil and handling the recoil and stuff like that. Yes, the build is a bit slow, but if you can read the mini map, if you know where the enemies are coming from, you can really anticipate things like that. And, and it's, uh, it's slow, but it's not that slow. So uh, definitely give this a shot. You guys can see the stats right there. I mean, we bumped damage, we bumped the, the range, we bumped the accuracy, we bumped a little bit of the mobility there. Uh, so try it out for yourselves. This is a really good setup. Um, the gameplay that you're about to see is about to speak for itself also. Try this out. Yep. Oh! Really? Got right here. Ah! <laughs> I wanted it. What is this guy doing? Teammate, what the hell are you doing? ready to deploy. Wow, this class setup feels really good, chat. This class feels Copy. amazing right now. Need ammo. Friendly UAV on station. Ghost. Friendly cluster. Be so ready to deploy. What the hell is this guy doing? Got a choppy gun, we got a veto. Lagging a bit. Oh. Oh, really? You're just gonna sit there like a little bitch, huh? All right, here, sit sit there for this. Sit, sit there for this, bro, don't move. Stay there, bro. What the hell is this guy doing? Looking for me? Looking for me, asshole? Bring more. Bring more of your buddies. Yeah, bring the whole team. Bring the whole team. That's what you need. Covering your stick. Eyes, UAV is exiting Yo. Stop lagging. Damn it. Keep it up. All saber, mission accomplished. Uh yeah, this is it. This this is it, chat. Give it a try.
all right well ladies and gentlemen man i hope you guys enjoyed today's video i hope you guys enjoyed the class setup and the gameplay and everything uh give it a shot try it out just the way i laid it out there for you guys with the specific tuning as well uh let me know what you guys think if there's something that you want to mix and match or whatever by all means go ahead but definitely give this build a try thank you so much for stopping by today's video if you guys are brand new around here don't forget to subscribe to the channel turn on notifications and drop a like on today's video i'd really appreciate that any feedback comments questions concerns uh please let me know in the comment section below and once again thank you so much for 70 000 subscribers here on youtube unbelievable let's keep working and uh once again that's that's hashtag ask gray in the comments if you guys are looking to have a comment featured in our upcoming q a video if you guys are looking to get any control freak products you can now use code gray over at checkout to get a 10 percent discount off your purchase link in the description below to control freaks website if you guys are looking to get any g fuel products you can always check out their website link in the description below you can use code yt gray at checkout to get a great discount they have a bunch of different hydration packs tubs uh shaker cups cans a lot of stuff over there if you guys are looking to get a new controller highly recommend checking out aim controller uh, i've been using aim controls for about two years and we recently got sponsored by them they have a bunch of great customization options um and recently they've reduced the overall price of controller builds so go check that out you can use code gray or just click on the link in the description below make sure to give us a follow over on our kick streaming platform i actually should be live later tonight leveling up the new ISO 45 SMG and then basically coming up with the class setup for it so expect a class setup video for the ISO 45 coming up soon yeah give us a follow over on kick link in the description below and uh make sure also give us a follow outside of YouTube on our social media platforms TikTok Twitter Instagram Snapchat links to everything in the description below I'm gonna call it there you guys thank you so much once again for watching till the next one my name is Gray peace